The eviction and demolition was the fifth in the area, according to the affected squatters who claim to have lost properties worth thousands of shillings. A section of the squatters who spoke to journalists blamed the recent killing of one of their colleagues on a land broker they suspect to be colluding with local police boss to evict and demolish their houses. Na haya yote ambayo tunasumbuliwa nayo ni mambo ambayo ni mambo ya haki. Kwa sababu sisi ni masquota na hizi ardhi ambazo tumezimezikalia ni ardhi ambazo wenyewe ni wale absentee landlords. Na kwa hakika sisi tumekaa hapa kwa muda mrefu sana. Ama hawa wakazi ambao wamekaa hapa wamekaa hapa kwa muda mrefu sana. Na haya ma maonevu ambayo yanafanyika led by Hashim Loma Makazi, chairman of Mombasa Squatters Association, blamed local police for encouraging perpetrators of illegal eviction and threats against them. The chairman called on the police to stop the tendency of disobeying legal court orders and abuse of fundamental rights of squatters. Hivi leo askari wamekuja hapa bila oda yoyote na juzi tumekuwa kotini na koti mesema ile status quo ya hii shamba ambayo imetolewa kama oda iweze kubakia mpaka watakapotoa final verdict. Lakini tunashanga bwana OCS wa Bamburi police station amekuja hapa na maskari na kuweza kuwavunjia wale ambao ni squatters wa shamba hili na kuweza kuwaangaisha baadhi ya wengine na hata wengine kuwaonyesha bunduki kuambia kuwa wakifanya mchezo watawaua. Na hatungeweza kuwasongelea kwa sababu tulikuwa tukiwafuata wao wanatutolea nini mabunduki wakisema watatupiga risasi. Imebidi tumuite kiongozi wa kisauni nzima ili tuonyeshe atumuonyeshe vile tunavyopata shida. Kama kuna njia yoyote ambayo anaweza katuonyesha ama katusaidia tukapata. Mr. Makazi is now calling on President Uhuru Kenyatta and Mombasa Governor Ali Hassan Joho to intervene on their behalf. Darius Bakari a squatter whose house was demolished said they have experienced five consecutive demolitions sisi kama jamii ya squatters hapa kisauni tunatoa mwito huu kwa bwana rais wa jamhuri hii ya Kenya bwana uhuru mjai kenyata na bwana governor wa Mombasa bwana Ali Hassan Yoho tafadhali tunawaomba sana kupitia serikali kuu na kupitia serikali ile ya county mateso ambayo sisi tunayapata kama squatters tunatoa Tunatoa onyo kwa serikali yetu ikiwa ma, ikiwa maonevu kama haya yataendelea sisi kama jamii ya squatters hapa pwani sisi nasi itabidi tuangalie ni njia gani ambayo sisi wenyewe tutaweza kujisaidia a high court in Mombasa on 31st January 2020 issued the status quo order in a case filed by three people against the squatters However, the broker who claims ownership of land through Ellen Properties Limited came with goons led by police officers dangling another court order. They claim to have allowed them to evict squatters from the land. The evictions are known to be carried out by police and hired goons only over the weekends and during holidays according to the squatters. They now want local police bosses to be transferred and action taken against perpetrators of illegal eviction and killing in the area.